Hello, and welcome to this Shirin Looper's tutorial. In this video, I'll show you how to update the firmware on your Shirin Looper Plus. The Shirin Looper Plus requires a day one firmware update, so follow this tutorial closely to ensure full functionality and feature access. Before updating your Looper Plus's firmware, be sure to back up any loops you've created and saved on your Looper Plus to your computer or an external storage device. Visit the link in the description for a video walkthrough on how to back up your data. So, our first step is to download the Shirin Looper Plus Firmware Updater software. In your web browser, go to shirinloopers.com forward slash support. You can also navigate to this webpage automatically by scanning the QR code found on your Looper Plus's quick start guide and product box. Under Looper Plus, click Learn More to arrive at the support and downloads page for the Looper Plus. You'll notice a section in the lower right corner for registering your Looper to your InMusic profile. We highly recommend registering your Looper to stay up to date on future feature updates, tutorials, announcements, and more. If you haven't registered your Looper yet, check out the links in the description for short videos on how to create an InMusic profile and how to register a product to it. At the top of the page, you'll see download links for the latest Looper Plus firmware for both Mac OS and Windows computers. Click the link for your computer's operating system to begin downloading. If you're using a Windows computer, be sure to also click the download link for the Looper Plus PC driver. This driver needs to be installed on your computer for it to be able to communicate with your Looper. Since the firmware updater will download as a zip file, you'll need to unzip it before running the software later. On Mac OS, simply double-click the zip file, and the firmware updater will be automatically unzipped in the same location. On Windows, double-click the zip file to open it, then click and drag the contained .exe file to your desktop or other location on your hard drive. Once the .exe file is copied, double-click it, then follow the installation prompts to get the firmware updater installed on your computer. Don't forget to do the same for the Windows driver. Double-click the downloaded zip file, extract the contained .exe file, then double-click the .exe file and follow the prompts to install the driver. The driver must be installed before attempting to update your Looper's firmware. Now that our software is ready to go, let's get your Looper Plus powered on and connected to your computer. The Looper Plus comes with four AA batteries. Simply open the battery compartment on the bottom of the Looper Plus, insert the batteries as directed in the battery slots, then close the battery compartment. Next, press the power button and wait until the display says ready. Grab a standard USB cable and connect the USB-B end into the USB port on the rear panel. Then connect the USB-A end to an available USB port on your computer. We recommend plugging the USB cable directly into one of your computer's built-in USB ports. USB extension cables and hubs may slow the rate of data transfer. So, without further ado, let's update the firmware. On Mac OS, double-click the unzipped DMG file then double-click Shirin Looper Plus Firmware Updater. On Windows, you can open the installed firmware updater by locating it in the Apps section of the Windows screen. The updater will recognize your Looper Plus and list the firmware point version that's currently installed on it. As you can see, compared to the point version in the updater, my Looper Plus's firmware is out of date. All you have to do is click Update Firmware, and the update process will begin. Be sure not to unplug the USB cable, or power off your Looper Plus or computer during the update process. Once the new firmware is installed, your Looper Plus will reboot, and the updater will confirm that the firmware has been successfully updated and that you can exit the application. You can double check that the new firmware is installed on your Looper Plus by pressing and holding the encoder to open the menu, then scroll until About appears, then press the encoder. To access more resources, tutorials, and technical support for Shirin Looper products, head over to shirinloopers.com forward slash support. You can also find more Shirin Looper video tutorials in our Shirin Looper support playlist here on YouTube. You can find that link down in the description. Thanks for watching and enjoy using your new Shirin Looper Plus.